my friends i welcome you all to the creative thinkers up channel today's video might be a little short but i think it's going to be one of the most useful videos for anybody who is is a part of my channel or you know my channel is reaching them now today what are we going to be doing is that we are going to be seeing that how we could have chat gpt integrated into our microsoft powerpoint okay so what you can do is that basically you can take the power of uh, chat gpt and put it uh, and put it directly at just a small prompt you can create a whole ppt at a click of a button it's going to be useful for all people who are into business as well as school and college children who need to create presentations once in a while so for that first what we are going to be doing is that go to platform.openai.com okay and you will be coming to this screen now what you need to do is that i've got forums here here you will have login let's do one thing let me log out okay so this is the screen that you will be seeing what you need to do is that once you come here say continue with microsoft account so for all my friends you need to be having a legit uh, account with your uh, microsoft so it should it should be a registered microsoft account that's a that's a compulsion then you will be getting a particular prompt where you will be said that okay now i want to download this now where do you download this is that you come here to uh, use chat gpt to automate powerpoint okay how you could come here is that chat type type chat gpt to powerpoint slides in your google search okay and you will come to this page you click on this page listendata.com and this is where you will open you download this add on okay so this will look something like this this will look something like this now what you need to do is open this that wherever this thing is come here and say in properties you have to make sure that it is unblock okay it has to be unblock say add remove read only say unblock and apply that's it this is what you need to do okay this is done now and while you are doing this you have to come here into api api keys so once you click here no it will tell you okay, okay can you please log in once again so you need to log in once you log in okay you are going to be asked that what is the name of your organization and what is your date of birth you put both these things okay and once you once you say okay you need to say that okay i want to create my api secret password and what i did i created my api secret password i will tell you that you know you copy this key and you keep it safe with you now if you log see this website it also tells you that how the key will look okay so this will even give you the stepwise thing as per what i am saying right now okay view api keys we went we saw that create a new secret key we saw that too okay and then save the api key on a word or you know something that you're always accessing uh safe it will look like skxxx as you can see here okay it's an x sk xxx key okay and created so and so date that i created it today itself and last use i've never used it in that way you can create multiple api keys okay that done now let's do one thing let's go to this particular thing but let's start powerpoint we open this come into file okay options in some uh, in a older version you might even get more okay so go into more say add-ins okay and come here and say powerpoint add-ins and say go now see where this add-in is located okay the add-in of our gpt now it's in microsoft edge temporary files let's not let's take it out from here let's keep it in downloads okay so this add-in let's keep it in downloads now we come here oh sorry we come to our say add in and uh, say downloads and here it is and say okay now can you see this so enable macros and here your chat gpt is there so just close this and my friends we have chat gpt to our access right here so you click in PPT maker okay please type the topic of your presentation below let's say um, uh, steps to add 
chat gpt to power point okay slides 10 and say submit once you submit it's going to create the whole thing for you there it is okay how do you use chat gpt for powerpoint adding chat gpt to powerpoint welcome to the introduction okay yes this might go a little little topsy turvy okay all you need to do is just pull things down i think so there there it is click on chat gpt main navigation bar appropriate whatever that is there so you uh, depends on what chat gpt you have open ai playground we went to that begin typing the message to start your conversation chat gpt will respond chat gpt to powerpoint you can either take screenshots and then you come adding chat gpt to powerpoint significantly enhances your creativity and that's the end of the slide so my friends that's how we added chat gpt to powerpoint in just no time and our presentation is ready all you'll have to do is add relevant images and you're done so now if you think that this is a little dry all you need to do is just go into design tab okay and come here put your design and you are back in action so my friends now this is how we work chat gpt in powerpoint but if you go further okay you will realize that chat gpt plugin is also there for ms excel and ms word all you need to do is just click on this come down okay everything is all the same you have to log in into platform which we already have and all you need to do is just download the add-on get into microsoft excel uh, moreover uh, go into the add-on you have to uh, unblock it add it in the same way how we did for powerpoint do the same with word and i'm sure that this is going to help you all throughout where you have chat gpt not even only in your powerpoint but in your word as well as excel so that my friends i'm sure is going to help all of us if you like this video please like subscribe and do not forget to share because only sharing increases knowledge thank you